Welcome to our video on the Arduino Uno Rev 3. In this video, we will explore the various components and features of this popular microcontroller board. From its built-in LED and versatile analog inputs to its powerful microcontroller and programmability, the Arduino Uno Rev 3 is a fantastic tool for electronics enthusiasts and hobbyists. Join us as we take a closer look at each component and discover how they contribute to the board's functionality and versatility. Built-in LED The built-in LED on the Arduino Uno Rev 3 is connected to digital pin 13. It serves as a visual indicator and can be controlled by your code. You can turn it on or off, or make it blink at different intervals to provide feedback or status updates in your projects. 16 MHz Resonator The 16 MHz Resonator on the Arduino Uno Rev 3 provides accurate timing for the microcontroller. It consists of a crystal oscillator and capacitors that create a stable clock signal, ensuring precise timing for your code execution and synchronization of operations. ICSP for AT Mega 328P, the in circuit serial programming ICSP header is a set of pins that allow you to program the AT Mega 328P microcontroller using an external programmer or another Arduino board acting as a programmer. It enables you to upload your code and firmware to the microcontroller making it a crucial feature for development and debugging. Crystal Oscillator The Crystal Oscillator is a small component that provides precise timing for the microcontroller. It uses a quartz crystal to generate a consistent clock signal, which helps synchronize operations and ensure accurate timing for functions such as delays, timekeeping, and serial communication. ATmega 328P Microcontroller the ATmega 328P microcontroller is the main processing unit on the Arduino Uno Rev 3. It contains the central processing unit, CPU, memory, RAM and flash, and various peripherals. The microcontroller executes your code, manages inputs and outputs, and controls the overall behavior of the Arduino board. Analog inputs, the Arduino Uno Rev 3 provides six analog input pins labeled as 0 to a 5. These pins allow you to connect analog sensors or devices that generate continuous voltage signals. The microcontroller includes an analog-to-digital converter, ADC, that converts the analog signals into digital values, which can be read and processed by your code. Voltage in, ground pins, the voltage in and ground pins provide connections for external power sources. The voltage in pin allows you to provide an external voltage reference when needed such as for analog sensors or specialized components. The ground pin serves as the common reference point for the electrical circuit, ensuring proper functioning and signal integrity. 5V Power Pin 3.3V Power Pin The 5V Power Pin and 3.3V Power Pin on the Arduino Uno Rev 3 supply regulated power to other components or devices connected to the board. The 5V Power Pin provides a stable 5V output, while the 3.3V power pin supplies a lower voltage option suitable for certain sensors or devices with lower voltage requirements. Reset pin The reset pin on the Arduino Uno Rev 3 is connected to the reset circuit of the microcontroller. It allows you to restart the microcontroller by triggering a system reset. Pressing the reset button or applying a reset signal to this pin restarts your code execution from the beginning making it useful for resetting the board state. 3.3V Regulator The 3.3V Regulator on the Arduino Uno Rev 3 regulates the voltage to a stable 3.3 volts. It ensures that components requiring this voltage level receive a consistent and reliable power supply. This voltage regulator allows you to power compatible devices or sensors directly from the Arduino board. External Power Supply The Arduino Uno Rev 3 can be powered using an external power supply connected to the board. It provides flexibility when working with power hungry components or when using the board in standalone projects where USB power may not be sufficient. The external power supply can be connected to the power jack on the Arduino board. 5V Regulator The 5V Regulator on the Arduino Uno Rev 3 regulates the voltage to a stable 5 volts. It ensures that components requiring this voltage level receive a consistent and reliable power supply. This regulator is responsible for powering various components on the board and can deliver sufficient current for most Arduino projects. 
LM358. The LM358 is a dual operational amplifier integrated circuit IC included on the Arduino Uno Rev3. It provides two independent amplifiers that can be used for various analog circuit applications. You can utilize the LM358 for amplification, filtering, signal conditioning, or other analog operations in your projects. Polyfuse, the polyfuse on the Arduino Uno Rev3 acts as a self-resetting fuse. It is designed to protect the board from overcurrent situations. If the current exceeds a certain threshold, the polyfuse temporarily interrupts the circuit, preventing damage to the board. Once the fault is removed, the polyfuse automatically resets itself, allowing normal operation to resume. USB TTL Converter, USB Plug The USB TTL converter on the Arduino Uno Rev3 allows you to connect the board to your computer using a USB cable. It handles the conversion of serial data between the microcontroller and the computer, facilitating programming, communication, and data transfer. The USB plug is the physical connector on the board where you can insert the USB cable. ICSP for 8 Mega 16U The ICSP header for 8 Mega 16U is used to program and communicate with the 8 Mega 16U microcontroller on the Arduino Uno Rev3. The 8 Mega 16U handles USB communication and is responsible for tasks such as emulating a USB to serial converter, allowing the board to be recognized as a virtual serial port on your computer. Reset button. The reset button on the Arduino Uno Rev3 is a tactile switch that allows you to manually reset the microcontroller. When pressed, it triggers a system reset, restarting the code execution from the beginning. The reset button is useful for initiating a fresh start or to troubleshoot issues during development. Analog reference pin. The analog reference pin on the Arduino Uno Rev3 is labeled ARIF. It allows you to set the reference voltage for the analog to digital converter, ADC. By providing an external reference voltage, you can adjust the maximum voltage range that the ADC can accurately measure. This feature is beneficial when working with analog sensors or when you need precise control over the ADC range. Digital ground pin. The digital ground pin on the Arduino Uno Rev3 is labeled GND. It serves as the reference point for the digital signals on the board. It is connected to the common ground of the circuit, ensuring proper signal integrity and stable voltage references for the digital components. Digital I.O. pins, 2 to 13 The Arduino Uno Rev3 offers a total of 14 digital I.O. pins, numbered from 0 to 13. These pins can be individually configured as either input or output. You can use them to interface with digital devices such as sensors, actuators, LEDs, or other microcontrollers. These pins allow you to control the state of the devices or read their digital signals using your code. Serial Out, TX, Serial In, RX The Arduino Uno Rev3 has two pins dedicated to serial communication, TX, Transmit, and RX, Receive. These pins allow the Arduino to send and receive data to and from other serial devices, such as computers, sensors, or other microcontrollers. You can use these pins to establish serial communication links, enabling the exchange of data and information between devices. These detailed explanations should provide you with a comprehensive understanding of each component and its role on the Arduino Uno Rev3. That concludes our video on the Arduino Uno Rev3. We hope you found this overview of its components and features helpful in understanding the capabilities of this remarkable development board. With its robust microcontroller, abundant I.O. pins, and support for a wide range of sensors and peripherals, the Arduino Uno Rev3 opens up endless possibilities for your creative projects. Thank you for watching, and we encourage you to experiment, explore, and make the most of the Arduino Uno Rev3 in your own electronics endeavors. Happy tinkering!